JetBlue Airlines is entering a new, dominating age that people could argue is the future of the airline industry. Today we look at their stunning plans for their new livery. Welcome to the flight deck where we strive to bring you the most updated information specifically but not limited to the US carriers. If you want to make sure you're not getting blindsided by the airlines, hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss another video. For a bit of a surprising turn JetBlue has revealed a significant change in its branding with a livery update. The airline based in the United States will now see an evolution that moves the company ahead into its next era. The first aircraft to sport the change is their Airbus A321, equipped with the Mint Business Class Suites. Notably the most significant change if you will comes in the form of a full-body paint representing the blue of jet blue, while there's also a substantial upgrade to the aircraft's tail design with time all aircraft in the JetBlue fleet are said to see this new livery painted on to reflect the changes, it will be a lengthy process and it will tie in directly with each respective unit's touch-up schedule so no the airline won't say be bringing them in at a more accelerated rate to make the changes that means for those aviation enthusiasts that will be out trying to capture the old JetBlue livery now you'll have plenty of opportunities to do so thanks to JetBlue's sizable fleet the logo mark will be more significant with the refresh meanwhile the tail pattern replaces the existing design and will drag down the aircraft's body winglets have also got an Avery vamp with true vibrant colors featured throughout it's all part of JetBlue's wider focus to enhance its identity and be Seen invisible more widely across the country, a paint scheme such as this will certainly do the trick you'd like to think JetBlue has always been known for its vibrant tails and fun from different designs featured widely across its fleet. This is part of maintaining an image and ensuring, as the airline says themselves, that you never truly get bored of seeing JetBlue in the skies or on the ground. And you're kept on your toes wondering what aircraft you'll see next delivery is part of a brand. Refresh that has already been underway for some time so while not expected it maybe doesn't come as big of a shock as save when Emirates unveiled their own upgrade that being said the evolution of the JetBlue livery is substantially bigger than Emirates with JetBlue now being a full body scheme which makes it very hard to miss and if you were to put the old livery pad with this livery at two side by side gates. At the airport the airlines would look pretty unrecognizable by the main logo Mark IV. Most new branding can be very hit or miss within some instances it's striking an immediate accord and in other cases it can be largely received in negative manner that's the beauty of opinions one thing that is almost certain is that welcoming and change in the aviation industry is a lot easier said than done when you get so used to something for such a period especially a rebranded jet blue. So what fence do you find yourself on are you a fan of it, maybe need to warm up to it, or do you outright not like it? I'd be interested to hear your take down below in the comments. And make sure you hit that subscribe button I post every day on the aviation industry around the world. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Peace.